All right. Uh, this is why you have a Bible. And it's actually pretty common sense, but a lot of people don't catch on to that. You get into the Word of God because that's what God has for you. That's our information. This is what this is what this is our information for the earth. So a lot of people are falling into the trap of now that doesn't mean like I couldn't write a book and, and explain things a little bit and all that doesn't mean that. But we don't go by outside sources. Everything's in here. Now, common sense, if I said to you, well, what religion are you, right? Most people will, will, will identify themselves as either they're not religious, okay? Or they'll say, well, I'm a Baptist or I'm a Pentecostal or I'm something like that. But you don't realize what you're doing in that moment. You're separating yourself. You think you're right. Now, if I'm, a, if I'm someone who doesn't know anything about Christianity or Bible or anything, and I'm just looking at a bunch of people who think they're right, why are you right? Well, I get in my Bible and I read it. Well, I do too. Now, I, now here's where I got you. I read my Bible. I've been reading this over 40 years, and folks, I don't see what other people see. What I do see out in the world is people twisting it or perverting it. If God says, don't cover your head when you preach, you'll find someone that'll cover their head. If God says children obey your parents, children will take over and try to try to rule their parents. When God says women, you have a place at home, oh, women got to be like men. When God says man, serve God, you don't do those things. Men will try to do those things. Men will try to dominate and have power and judge and all kinds of weird stuff we're doing. People twist things. People don't understand what judgment is. Judgment's final. Telling someone their sins is not judgment. You know, we, we just have so many things twisted. Our dialects are all messed up, so we don't understand half what we're saying. Read your Bible every day. That's how you know. It doesn't matter to me who comes to me or who says what. This is what God gave me, and I have prayer, and I walk with him every single day. See, they don't want you to think it's that simple. They don't want you to think it's that easy to get in the Word of God every single day. Now, I read the King James Version original because it's the purest of the English for easy for me to understand. Read your Bible every day. Read your Bible every day. Pray. Do what God says to do. Don't just talk about it. Do it. You're going to make mistakes, but don't make them. Keep focusing on doing the right thing. Read your Bible every day. Test all spirits with what the Word of God says, and you'll find that a lot of people are getting it twisted. Now, I love you either way, and I pray for the day to you to come out of it and see it. But wake up, folks. God bless you. We love you. Read your Bible. Let this be your answers. There's too many perversions nowadays. The end time says that, don't it? God bless. We love you.